This is the Pentax K30, the company's latest mid-range DSLR. Despite being a less expensive model, it takes most of the features of the K5 and a couple of the latest upgrades introduced with the K01 mirrorless camera. It features an updated 16 megapixel sensor and Pentax's latest processor, enabling it to shoot 1080p video at 30 frames a second, rather than the 25 that the K5 was limited to. And Pentax has also redesigned the optics in front of the autofocus sensor, so it promises better performance in that respect too. From the K01, it gains features such as focus peaking, which oddly isn't available while shooting video. Since it uses the same sensor and processor as the K01, it should also share that camera's image quality. The K30 can shoot at 6 frames a second, which is only a little less than the 7 frames per second offered by the K5. In most other respects, it'll happily go toe-to-toe -to -toe with its larger brother. The K30's angular design is certainly distinctive. We think most people will either love or hate its looks. The flash overhangs the front of the camera, giving rise to the unusual angled back nameplate. Flip it up and you discover it's a purely aesthetic flourish. Some of the design is practical though, as the camera is extensively weather sealed, which is unique for a DSLR at this price point. Open the rather large weather sealed battery door and you'll find a fairly small lithium ion battery. This is because the compartment has been designed to accommodate four AA batteries, if you buy the appropriate adapter. As mentioned, it can shoot at six frames a second and its shutter volume is about average. The K30's specifications are certainly impressive especially considering its status at the time of launch as the least expensive weather-sealed DSLR on the market. 